Hi, I'm Mike, and this is an intro. All right, this card is Dragon Scale General, the four drop, three colorless, one white, two three. That is a giant, massive meh. I I really want to like this creature. I really want to like it. I mean, it is an exponential buff, sort of, and it is massively powerful, sort of, and it is. A human warrior, two combinations I really like. Yeah, you know, okay, there's there's no sort of about that. I actually like those combinations. But it's this card is any setup that you could take advantage of this card is a setup that you really don't need it. Now, I mean, you can always go the old fashioned method of just dropping in uh, Darian, King of Keldor, and just pumping out tokens, and that whenever your turn starts, one of them gets exponentially huge. And I mean, that that's scary. That, that's very scary. But really, people will just kill him and not worry about it. Granted, I would still use that combo because it, you know, it makes people worry if you could protect him or her. Or you can then, you know, do something like uh, Champion of Lamholt, because then whenever creatures are popped out, she gets bigger. And then whatever you buff with Dragon Scale just won't get blocked, so you know you're going to hit for more, and that's almost a guarantee. And then, you know, there's always the Rise idea. You pump out tokens, you pump out more tokens, and then you start doubling all the tokens. Altogether, these cards work incredibly well. But the problem is, in all these cards and all the really great interactions, the General just kind of falls flat. She's good, and she makes it better, and if you're running out of space in a deck, but you still have a few spots left, and you're not really sure what to go with, she's not a bad choice. I think that's a she, I'm not actually sure. But, um, it's just, you have to wait for your upkeep. Sorry, uh, beginning of your end step. So not only do you have to, you know, not get it whenever you attack, it has to be at your end step, so you, after your attack phases and everything are done. So it's either going to be a tapped creature, which will be a giant target to kill, or it just won't be able to block. Or, you know, something that's up there, and it's a giant threat if they attack you, but it's just one creature. It it has potential, but honestly, I just... I want to like this card, but I just can't use it. That said, it's not a bad choice. So, if you can make it fit in the deck... Great. I would love to hear how that works out. I would love to see it. But for my most part, any deck that could use her is already running to the point where it doesn't need her. And that's the biggest problem with the card. It's fun, but I just don't think it's worth it. I eh, guess this is my first bad review of a card. Which is disappointing because I really wanted to like this thing. Oh well. I'm Mike. You know the deal. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. And please, if someone can make recommendations on how to make this card really useful, I want to hear it. So, um, yeah. Later.